We're happy to reveal that Robin is gay. Yes. <laughs> hey, good morning, America. Even though Robin Roberts is now celebrated as an icon and a highly respected figure in the LGBTQ plus community, her journey to becoming the person she is today was anything but easy. She faced numerous challenges, from the obstacles of homophobia to serious health battles, and each played a role in shaping her life and career. Robin Roberts, widely recognized as a beloved American television broadcaster, co-hosts Good Morning America on ABC. She grew up in Mississippi and later attended Southeastern Louisiana University, where she first pursued her interest in media. Robin initially launched her career as a sports anchor for local TV and radio stations, gaining experience and confidence along the way. Yet, Robin's life has been far from smooth. She openly shared her battle with myelodysplastic syndrome, MDS, a rare blood disorder, on the show. Her openness and vulnerability struck a chord with viewers and even earned the show a Peabody Award in 2012 for their heartfelt coverage of her journey. More recently, Robin has spoken about the complex challenges of being both a Christian and openly gay. She has candidly discussed the reactions within her community and the personal sacrifices she made in her journey to embrace her true self fully. Stay tuned for a deeper look at what's really happening behind the scenes with this inspiring Good Morning America host. Social Pressure and Health Struggles Robin Roberts has navigated an extraordinary personal journey, marked by deeply emotional moments and a commitment to living authentically. Raised in the Presbyterian faith, Robin practices both Presbyterianism and Transcendental Meditation, blending spirituality with a focus on inner peace. Her relationship with Amber Lane, a massage therapist, began in 2005, but she kept her personal life private for years. Though her close friends and co-workers were aware of her same-sex relationship, Robin publicly acknowledged her sexuality for the first time in December 2013. This disclosure was a significant step, and it was later recognized when she was named one of the 31 icons of the 2015 LGBT History Month by the Equality Forum. Recently, in September 2023, Robin and Amber took the meaningful step of getting married, affirming their enduring love nearly two decades after they first met. Robin's public coming out happened through a heartfelt Facebook post in December 2013, where she expressed gratitude for the love and support she received during her battle with myelodysplastic syndrome MDS. In the post, she thanked her family, friends, and Amber, making their relationship public for the first time. Although her inner circle had known for years, this marked her first public statement about her sexual orientation. Robin had kept her relationship mostly private, not out of secrecy, but because she worried about how her personal life might affect her public role as the co-anchor of Good Morning America. Her Christian faith also played a role in her hesitation, as she feared her identity as a Christian and a lesbian might appear conflicting to some and lead to judgment or alienation from her community. One particularly moving moment for Robin came when she received a supportive letter from the National Office of the Presbyterian Church after her coming out easing her fears of a backlash from her Christian community. Looking back, she often shared how much time she had spent anxiously wondering how people would respond. Deciding to come out was also influenced by her health challenges, her battle with breast cancer in 2007 and later with MDS in 2012. These life-changing experiences helped her see the importance of embracing her true self and living openly. Since coming out, Robin has actively advocated for LGBTQ plus rights, helping to increase visibility for the community in the media. Her relationship with Lane remains strong, and their marriage in 2023 solidifies their lasting connection. Robin's openness was an impactful moment for LGBTQ plus visibility, especially considering her status as one of America's most beloved television personalities. Recently, Robin discussed her experience of coming out during an interview on The Jamie Kern Lima Show, a podcast hosted by author and entrepreneur Jamie Kern Lima. During their conversation, she reflected on her fears before coming out, including her struggle to reconcile her Christian faith with her identity as a gay woman. She also shared how an interview she conducted with President Obama on marriage equality shaped her views. Robin felt that being open about her relationship might affect those close to her, especially considering how Good Morning America's success impacts the lives of many people. While she was not hiding her relationship, 
Her concern for others and their livelihoods made her cautious about going public. Through it all, Robin's journey has been a testament to courage, love, and the power of authenticity. Robin Roberts has long faced a unique challenge in reconciling her Christian faith with her identity as a gay woman, often fearing these parts of herself might be seen as incompatible. She once shared how this fear of rejection lingered for years, worrying that her faith community wouldn't embrace her fully. However, after coming out, she received a heartwarming letter from the National Office of the Presbyterian Church, offering her full support. This gesture profoundly impacted Robin, helping her realize that she had spent years worrying unnecessarily. In reflecting on her experience, Robin expressed how the warm acceptance she felt after coming out made her feel genuinely blessed, and she shared her gratitude for this acceptance from her community. The interview where Robin opened up about these experiences took place on The Jamie Kern Lima Show, a podcast that has quickly gained popularity, especially in the self-improvement category on Apple Podcasts. Since its release, it climbed into the top 15 podcasts on the platform overall, and listeners can find Robin's episodes on platforms like Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Amazon Music, and YouTube. Beyond her appearances on shows, Robin has also contributed to initiatives aimed at empowering young women. In 2018, she joined Disney's Hash Dream Big Princess campaign as a mentor, encouraging girls to chase their dreams and overcome barriers. Robin's life has been marked by resilience, especially concerning her health. In 2007, she was diagnosed with breast cancer, undergoing surgery and completing chemotherapy in early 2008. Then, in 2012, she was diagnosed with myelodysplastic syndrome, MDS, a condition that attacks the bone marrow. When she made her diagnosis public, it brought national attention to the importance of bone marrow donation, with Be The Match Registry witnessing an astounding 1,800% increase in donor signups. She took a leave from Good Morning America for her treatment, including a life-saving bone marrow transplant, and returned in February 2013. For her courage and transparency about her health struggles, Robin received a Peabody Award in 2012, was honored with the Arthur Ashe Courage Award at the 2013 SPIES, and was later awarded the NBA's Sager Strong Award in 2019. Her wife, Amber Lane, has also faced her health journey, sharing in a recent Instagram video her experience with medical menopause, a condition triggered by breast cancer treatments like chemotherapy and hormone therapies. Amber explained that medical menopause can begin suddenly due to treatments, causing symptoms such as hot flashes, night sweats, and mood swings, often creating unique challenges for women undergoing cancer treatment. Her candidness serves to build a sense of support for others dealing with similar issues. Amber has channeled her experiences into her brand, Plant Juice Oils, and has introduced a product called Chill Out Cooling Spray, crafted to bring relief from hot flashes. Amber's openness about her journey and her brand aims to connect with others facing similar health concerns, emphasizing the power of community support and solidarity. Robin's advocacy extends beyond her personal experience. She has highlighted the importance of equitable health resources, particularly for increasing diverse matches in bone marrow donations. Her work calls attention to disparities within the medical field, advocating for expanded research and donor outreach to bring hope to those in need. Robin Roberts and Amber Lane's relationship has been a source of resilience and love, supporting each other through major health battles and milestones. Amber's unwavering support during Robin's treatments for both breast cancer and myelodysplastic syndrome is a testament to their deep connection, which has only grown over time. Their marriage in September 2023 marked a beautiful chapter in their journey together, celebrated in a grand ceremony with 250 friends and family in their Connecticut backyard. For Robin and Amber, this moment was not just about their love, but also a reflection of the strength they've built through challenges. Sharing their story openly, they hope to inspire others to find strength in community and compassion, especially when facing life's trials. Robin's decision to come out publicly in 2013 was a significant moment, not only for her personally, but also as an influential figure in the media. She had long wrestled with the idea of being openly gay, especially as a Christian, fearing potential backlash and misunderstandings. 
When she revealed her relationship with Amber, it became a moment of empowerment for others who might be navigating similar struggles. Robin's openness about her journey has provided a powerful example of authenticity and courage, inspiring countless individuals facing similar concerns. Together, Robin and Amber stand as an example of love and support, showing the importance of being there for one another through all of life's experiences. In addition to her work on Good Morning America, Robin has shared her insights through several books that dive into her personal journey and life lessons. Her first book, From the Heart, Seven Rules to Live By, was published in 2007, with an updated edition in 2008. She continued with Everybody's Got Something in 2014, focusing on her experiences with illness and resilience, and her latest, Brighter by the Day, was published in 2022. Through these writings, Robin offers readers a glimpse into her positive outlook, using her own life's trials as a foundation to impart wisdom and strength. Robin also knows how to enjoy life, recently combining work and travel during a trip to Portugal with Good Morning America. She captured her journey by highlighting some of the country's top attractions, such as the Benigil Sea Cave, Pena Palace, and its stunning beaches. Portugal's landscapes, from mountain regions to scenic coastlines and celebrated wine country, left an impression on her. Robin even embraced a local culinary favorite, pastel de nata, a traditional custard tart. Although not typically drawn to sweets, she found herself quickly hooked on these delicious pastries, making them a staple of her Portuguese experience. Her admiration for the culture, people, and cuisine of Portugal shines through, showing her love for exploring and appreciating new places while staying grounded in her professional commitments. Robin Roberts shared practical travel tips that capture her love for fully immersing herself in new places. For anyone visiting Portugal, she emphasized the importance of sturdy walking shoes, as the country's diverse landscape requires plenty of on-foot exploration. This advice aligns with her commitment to experiencing destinations authentically, encouraging visitors to come prepared for Portugal's scenic but varied terrains. As a seasoned traveler, Roberts also shared her strategies for managing jet lag, such as staying hydrated and quickly adjusting to the local time, which she finds essential for maximizing her time abroad. One of the more memorable moments of her trip was meeting a group of elderly Portuguese singers who made a five-hour journey just to appear on Good Morning America. Their gesture of bringing gifts for Roberts touched her deeply, embodying the warmth and generosity that the Portuguese people are known for. The encounter was an impactful reminder of the meaningful connections travel can foster, allowing Roberts to experience Portugal's cultural richness firsthand. She contrasted Portugal's tranquil atmosphere with the fast pace of New York City, noting how she and her crew found a sense of calm amidst the peaceful soundscapes. For Roberts, Portugal's serenity left a lasting impression, underscoring the country's beauty and unique charm. This trip was more than just a backdrop for work. It became an enriching personal experience for Roberts, offering her not only cultural insights, but also a refreshing shift from her daily routine. Through her reflections, Roberts paints a vivid picture of Portugal's allure, from its landscapes and welcoming people to its unique cultural and culinary traditions. Robin Roberts is indeed a captivating figure, and understanding the depth of her story requires a look back at the world she grew up in. Life Journey Born in Tuskegee, Alabama, and raised in past Christian Mississippi, Roberts grew up in the South during a time of profound social change. This environment, along with her family's values, shaped her strength and resilience. Her father, Colonel Lawrence E. Roberts, was a Tuskegee Airman, which meant Robin grew up with a powerful example of perseverance and courage. Her family's experiences inspired her to face life's challenges with an unwavering sense of purpose. Robin Roberts' relationship with her father, Colonel Lawrence E. Roberts, has profoundly shaped her life and career. Growing up in past Christian Mississippi, Robin was raised in a close-knit family that valued hard work, resilience, and service. Her father, a Tuskegee Airman, was a significant source of inspiration for her, instilling in her the importance of perseverance and courage in the face of adversity. Colonel Roberts was one of the first African-American pilots in the United States Army Air Corps, serving during World War II. His experiences as a Tuskegee Airman were emblematic of the broader struggle for civil rights and equality for African-Americans. 
a legacy that deeply influenced Robin. As a child, she was aware of her father's remarkable achievements and the challenges he faced as a black man in a predominantly white military. This awareness fostered in her a sense of pride and responsibility to carry on his legacy. Colonel Roberts' story of determination and success in overcoming obstacles resonated with Robin, shaping her approach to challenges in her own life and career. Robin often reflects on her upbringing and the values her parents instilled in her. Her mother, Lou Samarian, was also a trailblazer, serving as the first black woman to hold the position of chairperson of the Board of Education in their hometown. This family background not only nurtured Robin's ambitions, but also emphasized the importance of education, community, and service. Growing up, she witnessed her parents' commitment to their community, which reinforced her belief in the significance of giving back and supporting others. Robert's childhood was marked by athletic pursuits, where she excelled in basketball and volleyball. She attended Southeastern Louisiana University, where she continued to shine as a student athlete, eventually becoming the university's first female sports broadcaster. Her early experiences in sports played a crucial role in her development, teaching her valuable lessons about teamwork, discipline, and leadership, qualities that would later serve her well in her journalism career. The challenges faced by her family, particularly regarding issues of race and gender, have also informed Robin's perspective as a journalist. Throughout her career, she has used her platform to advocate for diversity and inclusion, drawing from her personal experiences and the lessons learned from her father's and mother's struggles. This connection to her heritage has shaped her storytelling, emphasizing the importance of representation and understanding in media narratives. In the face of personal adversity, including her own health challenges, Roberts has often credited her father's influence as a guiding force in her life. When she was diagnosed with breast cancer in 2007, followed by a rare blood disorder in 2012, she leaned on the resilience and strength modeled by her parents. Her father's legacy not only inspires her in her career, but also provides her with the courage to face life's difficulties head on. Moreover, Roberts's connection with her father has inspired her advocacy work, especially in raising awareness about health issues. In 2021, she produced a documentary titled Tuskegee Airmen, Legacy of Courage, highlighting the stories of the Tuskegee Airmen and their impact on American history. This project was a tribute to her father's legacy and served to educate a new generation about the sacrifices and contributions of these heroic figures. Robin Roberts's relationship with her father transcends the personal. It encapsulates a broader narrative about resilience, representation, and the power of storytelling. By sharing her experiences and those of her father, she not only honors his memory, but also empowers others to confront their challenges, advocate for change, and strive for success against the odds. Throughout her life and career, Robin Roberts continues to exemplify the values instilled in her by her family, inspiring countless individuals along the way. When she first appeared on television, audiences likely had no idea of the strength behind her calm and warm demeanor. As a young journalist, Roberts wasn't just navigating a competitive industry, but also dealing with societal barriers. She faced sexism and eventually, the challenge of revealing her sexual orientation in a media landscape where that was far from easy. Her upbringing in a religious and socially conservative environment added another layer to her journey, particularly as she grappled with reconciling her Christian faith with her identity as a gay woman. All these early experiences laid a foundation for Robert's character, creating a resilience that has seen her through health battles, such as her breast cancer and myelodysplastic syndrome diagnoses, and personal challenges alike. Her story is one of transformation, from a Southern girl inspired by her family's values to a national icon who represents courage, authenticity, and self-acceptance on a public stage. Robin Roberts's broadcasting journey began humbly in 1983, anchoring sports for WDM-TV in Hattiesburg, Mississippi. This role set the stage for her early experience, after which she moved to Double Isle Locks TV in Biloxi in 1984. Her drive and dedication led her to WSMV-TV in Nashville by 1986, further building her profile as a sports anchor and reporter. She continued her rise at Waga TV in Atlanta from 1988 to 1990, expanding her media skills by hosting a radio show on V103. 
In 1990, Robin joined ESPN, becoming one of the most recognizable sportscasters of the decade. Her enthusiasm, especially with her signature phrase, go on with your bad self, made her a standout on SportsCenter. In 1995, she took on dual roles, becoming a contributor to Good Morning America, a collaboration that foreshadowed her future role on the show. In 1996, she even hosted ABC's Wide World of Sports, balancing ESPN duties with her expanding presence on ABC. In 2005, Robin's dedication paid off as she was promoted to co-anchor of Good Morning America. This new role set her on the path to transforming the morning show's ratings alongside George Stephanopoulos, who joined her in 2009. Their combined efforts helped GMA reclaim its top-rated spot in April 2012, displacing NBC's Today after a 16-year lead. Following Hurricane Katrina in 2005, Robin's deeply personal reports from her devastated hometown of Past Christian, Mississippi, brought national attention to the tragedy and cemented her reputation as an empathetic and resilient journalist. Robin's diverse career also includes unique moments like driving the pace car at the 2010 Indianapolis 500 and making a cameo on Disney's Hannah Montana in 2010. Her contributions to women's basketball were recognized when she was inducted into the Women's Basketball Hall of Fame in 2012, celebrating her impact both as a broadcaster and a player. In 2018, she co-anchored the royal wedding coverage for Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. And in 2021, she briefly hosted Jeopardy following Alex Trebek's passing. That same year, Robin began hosting Turning the Tables with Robin Roberts on Disney+, Plus, a series that brings out her talents as an interviewer. Robin's impact also extends beyond broadcasting. She appeared in Pitch Perfect 2 as a member of the Barden Bellas, showing her lighter side. And in 2014, she founded her own production company, Rockin' Robin Productions. Inspired by her father's legacy as a Tuskegee Airman, she executive produced Tuskegee Airmen, Legacy of Courage for the History Channel in 2021. This documentary not only honored the groundbreaking group of pilots, but also showcased her father's role in that legacy, tying her personal history into her professional work. Her journey from local news anchor to a prominent national figure with a multifaceted career is a testament to her resilience, adaptability, and passion for storytelling. Each role, project, and personal struggle has revealed a different facet of her character, shaping her into an inspiring figure who continuously uplifts those around her. Robin Roberts's accolades reflect a career defined by groundbreaking achievements and unwavering dedication. In 2001, the Women's Basketball Coaches Association awarded her the Mel Greenberg Media Award, honoring her impactful media presence in the sport. This early recognition was followed by the 2004 Billie Jean King Contribution Award, acknowledging her broader contributions to sports and media. In 2008, the WNBA Inspiration Award celebrated her influence on and off the court, and in 2012, she was inducted into the Women's Basketball Hall of Fame. Just two years later, she earned the Walter Cronkite Award for Excellence in Journalism, cementing her influence in media. Additional recognitions like her induction into the Sports Broadcasting Hall of Fame in 2016 and her honorary title as a Harlem Globetrotter in 2015 highlight her unique and pioneering role in sports broadcasting. The Radio Television Digital News Foundation awarded Roberts its Lifetime Achievement Award in 2018 and the National Association of Broadcasters followed suit with its Distinguished Service Award. The next year, she received the NBA Sager Strong Award, an accolade symbolizing strength and perseverance in the face of personal challenges. That same year, the U.S. women's national soccer team showed admiration by wearing jerseys with the names of women they respected. Alyssa Nahor proudly wore Robin's name, emphasizing her influence as a role model. In April 2022, Robin Roberts celebrated her 20th anniversary with Good Morning America during a heartfelt on-air ceremony. This milestone was marked by the unveiling of a plaque bearing her name, placed in Times D Square as a tribute to her significant impact on journalism and her ability to connect with audiences. Her legacy as a trailblazer in a traditionally male-dominated field has reshaped news delivery, blending journalistic integrity with an authentic approach. Roberts continued to receive recognition for her contributions, 
In 2023, she was named one of Out 100, celebrating her role in advocating for LGBTQ visibility and representation in media. The following year, she was awarded the Poyner Medal for Lifetime Achievement in Journalism, acknowledging her excellence in storytelling and her influence on future generations of journalists. Reflecting on her success in storytelling, Roberts celebrated the 10th anniversary of her production company, Rockin' Robin Productions, on September 3, 2024. She shared a touching side-by-side -side photo on Instagram, capturing herself in the same chair used during the company's original launch photo shoot. Roberts expressed pride in her journey and in the company's mission to tell stories that captivate, connect, and inspire audiences around the globe. She hinted at a month-long celebration, showing appreciation for her talented team and collaborators. Fans showered her with praise, lauding her skill and passion for storytelling, while Roberts shared a behind-the-scenes look at her Emmy-nominated Turning the Tables series, which airs on Disney+. In a follow-up post, she expressed gratitude for the women featured in the series and for the dedicated crew who helped bring it to life. Roberts has now embarked on an exciting new chapter, leaving her role at Good Morning America to take on a significant assignment in Los Angeles. She shared her farewell in an Instagram video, where she bid goodbye to her New York team, mentioning her anticipation for reporting from the upcoming Emmys. This transition is more than a career change. It reflects her adaptability and excitement to embrace fresh challenges in a new environment. Robin Roberts' new assignment in Los Angeles comes on the heels of a meaningful personal milestone. Her first wedding anniversary with wife Amber Lane, marking a period rich with both professional growth and personal joy. The couple, who wed on September 8, 2023, celebrated with a cozy, intimate dinner at home. Roberts shared glimpses of the evening's beautiful table setting and personalized menu, capturing the warmth of their relationship and the journey they've shared. It was a simple yet heartfelt celebration, symbolizing the love and support they have cultivated over their years together. Both Roberts and Lane have confronted serious health battles that have only strengthened their bond. Roberts first faced breast cancer in 2007 and later endured a rare blood disorder in 2012 that required a bone marrow transplant. These experiences have profoundly shaped her outlook on resilience and love. Lon's own fight with cancer began in 2021, culminating in her ringing the bell to celebrate the end of her radiation treatments in 2022. Their shared strength through these trials reflects the depth of their partnership and their mutual commitment to overcoming life's challenges together. Their wedding, held in the Connecticut backyard they call home, was a celebration filled with close friends, family, and many of Roberts' Good Morning America colleagues, underscoring her strong ties with the GMA team. The wedding's heartfelt moments, shared by Roberts on social media, offered fans a glimpse into their love story, one that radiates joy and resilience. The bond between Roberts and Lane is a testament to the power of unwavering support in facing adversity, bringing them closer with every step forward. As Roberts steps into her new role, her journey from Good Morning America to this fresh endeavor captures her readiness to embrace change and pursue new challenges. Fans, meanwhile, are eager to see what she will bring to this new chapter, certain that her resilience and passion will continue to inspire. Legacy Robin Roberts' trailblazing journey in journalism exemplifies resilience and determination, especially in a field that was traditionally dominated by men. Her rise through sports journalism, beginning at ESPN, set a precedent for aspiring female journalists, and her later role as co-anchor on Good Morning America cemented her influence. Through years of navigating gender biases and advocating for equal representation, Roberts has become a beacon for women in journalism, inspiring many who follow in her footsteps. Her legacy extends beyond her achievements. It encompasses her role in making journalism more inclusive, highlighting the importance of visibility for African Americans and LGBTQ individuals in mainstream media. By expanding diversity in the newsroom and among sports commentators, Roberts has helped shift the media landscape toward broader representation of race and sexuality, challenging stereotypes and enhancing inclusivity. Her transition from sports journalism to broader news topics illustrates the dynamic evolution of broadcast journalism itself. This shift enabled Roberts to delve into more emotionally resonant storytelling, 
setting a new standard for audience engagement. Her style, balancing thorough, serious reporting with warmth and relatability, has built significant viewer trust and loyalty. This approach, alongside her adept use of social media to share insights and personal stories, reflects her mastery of modern, multi-platform journalism, which is now essential in a digital age where audiences crave connection and accessibility beyond traditional broadcasts. Roberts's advocacy work further reinforces her influence, particularly her contributions to health awareness, diversity, and LGBTQ rights. Her public battles with breast cancer and myelodysplastic syndrome transformed her into a vocal health advocate, and she has used her platform to support initiatives like the Be The Match Registry, boosting bone marrow donor registrations, and emphasizing the importance of preventive care. Additionally, her openness about her sexuality has brought visibility to LGBTQ issues, particularly within religious contexts. By engaging in dialogues that normalize discussions about sexual orientation and faith, Roberts champions acceptance, using her public platform to foster understanding. Beyond health advocacy, Roberts is deeply invested in philanthropy, particularly in community and youth empowerment. Her efforts extend to supporting educational programs, mentoring young girls, and promoting diversity in schools. By advocating for these causes, Roberts continues to make a broader impact, inspiring positive change in education, community values, and inclusivity. Through each of these initiatives, her legacy as a journalist, advocate, and trailblazer is reinforced, and her story continues to inspire audiences and future journalists alike.